Pancakes, if you want any. I'm sorry we can't get you a hot dog. I know people just love those processed meats. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, that's really okay. Do you guys know what time it is? Um, oh, let's see. Uh, yeah, late. Um, it's 3 a.m. Do you think you could wait to cook this until the morning just because other people live here and I'd really like to go back to sleep? Oh, I'm sorry, did, did we wake you up? Yeah. We can definitely do this in the morning, Katie. <laughs> I'm r really sorry. Really sorry. Well, you could just sit and like have some pancakes. We have a lot, you know? Yeah, no. Um, I'm really tired, so I just want to go back to bed. If you could just be quieter um, and try not to burn the kitchen down or something. Okay. <laughs> Does she know how to have fun? <laughs> Sorry. Chug, <laughs> chug, 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 chug. <laughs> So, kids, now that Delilah has decided to grace us with her presence, we need to talk. One month. April 13th will be here before you realize, and I want you all to be completely prepared. I've taken another look at each of your compositions and I've sent you feedback via email. Some of you have made fantastic progress, but the standards are high. Have you finalized which five pieces we'll be doing yet? I really need to know so I can also begin to study. Also in the email. I know you wanted the Chopin, but I think you should stick with the Beethoven Sonata for more contrast. I know this means a lot to some of you. And the prizes are very prestigious. $5,000 and an internship is insane. But I need you to remember why you're doing this in the first place. Music is not about being the best. It's not about beating each other. Appreciate the music for what it is, and don't worry so much about winning. You all play beautifully. Now, I have to go to class. Don't hesitate to come to me if you have any questions or you need me to listen in. And we can extend our sessions this month if you need it. Thank you. Thanks. Good luck.
going on? We need to talk. Right now? What? Okay, if this is about last night, I'm really sorry. I promise it won't happen again. It's fine. Okay. You should come out with us sometime, you know? Do something fun besides just being perfect. No thanks. Well, we're gonna go out again this weekend. You should come. It's gonna be fun. Okay. Fine. What do you want to talk about? I don't want to go out with you tonight or any night, um, but thanks for asking. We need to discuss our study hours. The project is due right before the competition and I'm not gonna let you ruin my grades, so you can't keep staying out until 3 a.m. or joking around with Mason in class. Are you serious? You wanted to talk about studying? Oh my god, Katie, why do you always have to be like this? Wait, what am I being like exactly? Seriously? You don't know? Okay, look, you never speak to me. I, you never laugh. I don't think I've ever seen you smile. Can you ever just relax? Okay. 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 I give up, I don't want to be partners anymore. What, you're quitting? Delilah, why would I want to work with you? I hear the way you talk about me, not only to my face, but behind my back. You're always coming in late or hungover and flaking out on our meetings. Everyone knows you think you're better than you actually are. You're conceited and rude and arrogant, and I can't work with you. I tried to give you a chance, but it's not gonna work. You tried. <laughs> You've been horrible to me since you ever got here. You never talk. You never want to go out. You Look, I've been trying to get to know you, to make you, like, open up. It's a normal thing to do, but it's freaking impossible with you. You're like a fucking robot. Delilah, I'm only going to say this once. You don't know me, and you never will. So stop trying to make judgments about my life. And in a month, when you're too hungover to practice your sonata and your composition still sucks, I'm gonna be grateful to you. Because when you fuck up, it just makes me look better in comparison. And you'll understand that too, when I win. Katie. We got in a fight. What? Why? Why does it matter? I saw her crying. Her eyes were all puffy. She was trying to hide her face when she left, but I thought maybe you had class together. I didn't do anything. She's just been rude to me, like always. Why would she be crying? Hey, uh, Mason, where's Leo? Not here. Why? Do you need him? Yeah, he borrowed my bottle of hot sauce last week for the swim team's taco night and I kind of need it back. Well, he's on a date. Ooh. I need to take a walk. Are you stalking me now? I, I told you to leave me alone. Well, Ruby said you were upset, so I thought I might find you here. And what, you came to harass me? <laughs> yeah, something like that. Just leave me alone, Delilah, please. I just want to be left alone. Fine. I'll go. I'll ignore you and leave you alone and give up trying to get to know you if that's really what you want. Yes, it's what I really want. Please, go. Wait. Lila, I need to know how you do it. How I do what? When you play a piece, it's like, it's like you're not even really there. The music just 
flows through you and I don't know what you do. How do you do it? Did you just compliment me? I'm technically perfect. I always am, but my piece is nothing. Well, it's not nothing. You play flawlessly. It's not flawless. It's, it's lacking. I, how do you do it? Why do you want my advice all of a sudden? I thought you hated me. I don't hate you. Katie. I don't hate any of you, and you don't hate me, or else you wouldn't have come here. What? It's like you're always there. You're always wherever I am. It's like a curse. Cool. So, I, I'm a curse. Wow, that's very kind. Seriously, Katie? I just... I need to know how you do it. If I fucking knew that, I'd tell you. But I don't, okay? So what, what do you want from me? To tell you how to play better? Because I can't do that. I don't know. Jesus. Don't cry, please. Look, it's, it's just one competition. It's not it's just a competition. Are, are you having something... Is, some, is something wrong in your life? I can't talk about it. You should, you should leave. I should have just let you leave. Look, you need help. You're not making any sense. I'm... Is there... Is there someone you could talk to? Like, a, a friend? Your parents, then? Fuck. Katie, do you not have anyone? You should go. Go? I thought you wanted me to stay. I, I can't deal with you right now, Delilah. I need to practice. Well, you've been here since what? Four? You need to sleep. I'm not gonna beat you by sleeping. Well, you're not gonna win anything if you keep doing this to yourself. Working this hard is not healthy. You don't know anything about working hard. You know what I do when it gets too much? You get drunk and annoying. I make it fun, okay? Music should not be this stressful. It's like what Moretti said. It can't be perfect. Okay, I know he's weird, but he actually gives good advice sometimes. Now move over, please. I play this. You heard of this one? This is the first song my mom ever taught me. Okay, there's this one. Everyone on the planet knows this one. Maybe if we just entered as a duo, then we could both win. Look, Delilah, I don't, I don't really want you to lose. I, I just, I need to win. Yeah, well, but so do I. I mean, I just feel like it would suck a lot less if we didn't have to hate each other. And, and you know, it's going to be up to the judges anyway. Yelling at each other and ignoring each other isn't going to do anything. Maybe. I don't... I just, I can't be my best with distractions. I didn't come here to goof off and get drunk. I can't live like you guys do. And it, it's not that I don't want friends. I, I just, I can't. Well, maybe we could be friends. I don't know. Or we could try, you know. I know I'm, I'm lazy and irresponsible. And arrogant. And you're a workaholic who does not know how to have any fun. But we could try. Okay.